Lutner has one of the more exotic grand actions we're likely to run into. This action model from the PTG Foundation's Jack Wyatt Museum lets us see how it works in some detail. There is no whippin, and the hammer shank rests on a rail. The jack is attached directly to the key using a rocker. The jack's height can be adjusted by turning the two rocker screws using a special offset screwdriver. The hammer shank has a pinned abstract where the knuckle or roller would be. Its bottom is positioned by a pin riding in a hole in the rocker. The jack acts on a leather-covered heel that is part of the abstract, much like the butt leather of an upright. There is a curved spring with a button that limits the jack's motion and speeds its reset. Finally, a spring with a 90-degree bend runs from the front of the rocker to a felt-lined slot in the abstract. In this video, you can watch the parts in motion. The Blutner patent action is one of many alternate repetition actions, and it continued to be used well into the 20th century.